Hi guys, it's Mary and I'm back again with another plan with me for you guys, this time for the month of September! Oh my god, this year has gone by so quickly and anyways, beside the point, let's get started. As you can see, I am using my um, Sakura Pigma Micron pen in the 05 version in order to outline everything here in the title page and this month's theme is um, kind of retro tape theme. I guess that's the best way to explain it. It's kind of like 80s retro, but not really. And you'll you'll see what I mean um, as um, the video progresses. Um, but yeah, so I'm just using the Pigma Micron pen and also um, the mild liner in. Berry, and I believe it's called Dusk Blue, and a Crayola Super Tip in the light gray. I don't really know the formal name for that color, but yeah, if you guys know, you can always leave a comment down below on that. That would be awesome. Um, but yeah, and I'm also using a Crayola Super Tip in the darker gray. There's only two grays in the set, so. Um, I'm using the darker gray in order to kind of color in the outer part of the tape. But yeah, um, by the time this comes out, I will be in school again for the fall semester, yay! Um, not really, because I've been at... I've been doing... I've been doing classes, wait, I've been in class for like the entire year technically because I only had like a few weeks in between semesters and like summer semester and now to up to fall. So yeah, that's not really that fun. But anyway, uh, going back um, to bullet journaling, uh, I have my habit tracker. So I decided to go with a little of a kind of retro curly font. I don't know if it's really retro, but it's a curly font because it kind of goes with the font for September in the title page. I've been not inspired. I actually I imitated the exact same design of this title page for the theme from one of the lovely Pinterest people that I have seen and I will definitely leave a link to that person's artwork and where I got it from down in the description box below for you guys to check it out. Um, but yeah, there's so many talented artists and I'm not that talented as of yet to be able to think of like really creative and out-of-the-box themes, so I'm just going uh, to continue with recreations and imitations. But yeah, uh, I'm doing the habit trackers, the conventional tracker that I always use from uh, My Life in a Bullet with the dots uh, for each day of the month, for each habit that is drawn represented by a symbol drawing. It's pretty self-explanatory at this point because I have done it so many times. Uh, and then the conventional brain dump that I always have. And I'm using my Pentel Ain black eraser to erase all of the pencil marks that I left behind from drafting these spreads. So yeah. The only thing that is used the only thing that kind of incorporates with the theme is the stripes, the colors of the stripes, so the berry, blue, and gray stripes. Um, I thought it'd be easier for me to kind of manage instead of um, going in and putting like a whole bunch of like cassette tapes all over the place. Um, so yeah, and then here. Um, and by the way, um, so all of the recreations that I have done thus far, I've only imitated 
and recreated the title page itself. From there, I kind of, that was kind of my inspiration to uh, kickstart me in order to kind of make all of my spreads flow with the theme, if that makes sense. So um, here we have the monthly uh, layout with my uh, cassette tape header for September. Um, also, I've incorporated a YouTube tracker because now I have been doing YouTube for about, wow, about like seven months now, so just over half a year and that's amazing to think about and um, to know that all of you guys out there are watching my content and actually wholeheartedly uh, really like the content that I'm putting out which is amazing and I appreciate you guys so much for it. Um, so yeah, I thought I would be keeping track of my YouTube because I didn't think uh, that my channel would be at least growing bit by bit. So I wanted to see um, how much it grows within the next month. So I thought that would be pretty cool. And again, like last month, I am going in with the box idea. So the boxes are again 5x5. Five five. I don't remember what the habit, or not the habit, um, the YouTube tracker is essentially the dimensions for it are. I should have kept track of that. I will do a better job of kind of housekeeping with all the dimensions that I have uh, with my spreads in future videos. But yeah, I'm still kind of learning the ropes, trying to see what works, what doesn't, and trying to get myself all collected when I film all of the content for you guys. Um, but yeah, so I'm going again with the same font type theme idea um, being transferred throughout the monthly spread. And I also put a quote down in the corner as of right now, I don't remember what the quote was, but you guys can see it, so it's fine. So, oh, I can probably talk to you guys about um, the upcoming content that I will be pumping out for you guys in the next month or two. Uh, hopefully I can get around to it, fingers crossed. But of course, as a STEM student, I won't be able to be able to upload as regularly as I would like to. Um, but yeah, the upcoming um, videos that are going to be out are a back to school series. So uh, I'm in the middle of trying to get all of the videos filmed and then also edited. I'm in the middle of editing one of them and getting ready to film another. So there's that for you guys. Um, but yeah, I'm, there's also, you'll, you'll see what, uh, the back to school series, um, that I have will have, and hopefully that will help you guys, um, give a great kickstart to the school year. I know you guys are mostly in school by now, or just about getting started, um, to go back to school, so that'll be, um, hopefully good for you guys. Um, I know it's kind of dreading and kind of um, worrisome going back to school, but you guys can do it. I believe in you. Um, but yeah, this is the completed um, portion of the habit, or not the habit, the monthly um, log, I guess, uh, the monthly spread. And I'm coloring in in various colors uh, pertaining to the theme. Um, which boxes that I don't use because I realized that I didn't uh, want to draw a whole bunch of boxes but end up doing it anyway and I didn't want to do a whole bunch of white out on it um, so coloring it is um, I thought it turned out pretty nice and then moving on to the weekly spread so the weekly spread is just a whole bunch of cassette tapes and a whole bunch of um, kind of quotes sprinkled throughout the uh, page. I also have a highlights section for highlights of the week. Um, I have also added in a jam of the week because cassette tapes 
um, 80s retro I decided to um, put in or incorporate a jam of the week in order to incorporate with the theme I thought that would be pretty cool to do um, and then I have my meal plan so the goal of the meal plan um, tracker is to get myself to be able to meal plan at least one or two meals every single day of the week so to prep on Sundays for the rest of the week because um, I'm trying to get back into not get back but I'm trying to get into the habit of doing that to meal plan um, so that way when I go back to San Diego I will be all set and ready to go and get into the swing of things so yeah I'm just outlining um, again with my uh, Sikora Pigment Micron pen in the 05 version um, yeah this pen is actually getting to be kind of dull is starting to flatten so I probably need to invest in another um, not in another set preferably just only invest in one micron pen um, if that even exists but anyway um, beyond the point um, but yeah that is it for my September plan with me um, here's a flip through of the completed um, planning so I have my habit tracker with the days of the month and then the brain dump and also the monthly spread um, I like how it's like really put together really nice really poppin it also goes with the theme but um, in a simplistic type of way it's not really popping at you it's not kind of like aggressive to the eye I think um, but yeah and I had to erase that little part because I saw a little bit of a um, pencil mark but that's okay and then this is the uh, first of the many uh, weekly spreads that I um, did and yeah so I have um, that entire week into split into two spreads and also the meal plan um, uh, as I pointed there and the highlights and all of that jazz um, but yeah that is basically it for my plan with me for the month of September and I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did creating it and it, uh, recreating and also branching off from that. So yeah, if you did like it, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and also hit that subscribe button down below if you haven't already to catch up on the latest videos. I will catch you guys in the next video. Bye guys!